Ta-da! We will be ranking the new uniforms, the City Edition uniforms, for the NBA 2023-2024 season, to be exact. Last year's were pretty... Ugh. Let's see how this ones are. Alright, starting with... The Atlanta Hawks. I don't love this lettering. I don't love this color. They've used this color before. They still have the lift as we fly, like, motto thingy down here. Overall, uh, I don't hate it. At least it's, like, not completely boring. Like, they're doing something. There's, there's something going on on the jersey. So I'd say this is, like, probably C or B or something. I don't- I just don't love the colors. Okay, next team, the Boston Celtics. This is horrible. This is so unbelievably bad. This shade of green doesn't fit at all. The lettering is boring and uninspiring. This looks like something you would, like, buy for $15. Like a practice jersey. It's so unbelievably bad. I'm putting this in F. Okay, moving on to the Brooklyn Nets. This is similar to the uniforms they had last year, but the uniforms were a little more colorful. This time the lettering is more colorful. I don't hate it, but I just wish it wasn't all gray. If there was some more color in here, I think I would actually like it a lot. I think this is like a C or a B for me. Okay, maybe... I think it's better than the Hawks one, though. Okay, next one. Charlotte. I love this color, by the way, first and foremost. I... Don't say it. I don't love the CLT thing, because everybody just says it stands for something else. I like the lettering. I like the gold outline. I like the gold accents on the jersey. I think this is probably B or A. I just like the color a lot, okay? Uh, put it in A for now. Bulls. What is this? This color scheme has nothing to do with the bulls, okay? This, it doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. Look at it. Why is it, it's like, it's cream on white and like the lettering is so bland and boring. Oh my god, it's just awful. Bull horns? Uh, isn't bulls red? I know! It's supposed to be red. Ugh, F. Mavs? Okay, did listen. Oh, no, no, not Mavs. I thought it was Mavs because it's baby blue. No, because why wouldn't Cleveland be bla baby blue now? It's it's the land thing. Cleveland, the land. You might have heard it before. I don't know. I don't... I like the moniker. This lettering is good. It's interesting. I like this color. I just don't like it for the... I don't like it for the calves. Also, this, this cartoony, the this scribble thing over here, I like it. If it... If this was, like wine instead of baby blue i think i would rock with it a lot but it isn't so probably c maths i think this is almost worse than last year's they they stuck with this awful lettering i, I do like this little skid, uh, city skyline on here nix is s tier he, he knows he knows we're getting ahead of ourselves though white on white or gray on white? Dude, what are we doing? What are we doing? At least white is sort of a Mavs color. It's so bad, dude. It's so bad. It might be worse than the Celtics one. Nuggets. Hey, do, do you guys like white? Because we have more white jerseys. At least there's a splash of color here. This is the freaking altitude of Denver. Because it's very high above sea level. Ah. Uh... I think this is like a... Uh, maybe... The, the the colors do look nice, okay? I do like that. But it's just... Nothing, nothing about this has anything to do with Denver Nuggets. And that's the big problem with most of these uniforms. They just don't have anything to do with the teams. Let's go D. Pistons. Why is it cream colored? At least the lettering's cool. Um, I guess all of these jerseys have a little something about above the tag there. Uh, it's like a D as well. I think it's worse than the Denver one. I fuck with Pistons. It looks old. Yeah, at least like that. It looks kind of retro. Uh, Golden State Warriors. What is this, dude? Best color scheme. This is so bad. 
This is... What is this lettering? There's nothing in the middle. Why is there a hole? Something is supposed to be... Yeah, sure. But the Golden State Warriors is supposed to be gold and blue. Is the color scheme good? That's the... That's the... That's the freaking Hawks color scheme, bro. This doesn't belong to the freaking... They hold basketball there. This thing is ass. Um, yeah, sure, the color scheme's good. It doesn't fit the Warriors. This is freaking F tier. Sorry, AKG. Houston Rockets. Uh, H Town. I do like this lettering. Uh, but it also it looks kind of blurry. Maybe it's just the image. White again? Where's the color, bro? I mean, at least red is correct. Leaving stream for that take. Godspeed. Rockets look like it came straight out of a shitty 2000s NBA PS2 game. It it does look blurry. Why is it low res? Uh, it's bad. It's it's like D tier. At, hey, you know what? At least you got the color right. Thumbs up. Indiana Pacers. These are basically the same ones from last year, no? They basically look the same. I hate this shade of yellow with this shade of blue. The Pacers are blue and yellow. It's just not that blue and yellow. These are these are the wrong colors. It's fine though. It's it's fine. It's like the C tier. I just don't like the colors. The colors are off. The rest of the jersey is kind of good. It's just like too much. It's too much white. Okay, Los Angeles Clippers. <laughs> wow. Okay, I think they they've done their rebrand this year. There's nothing on this thing. It's just blue with black lettering. And like, okay, there's the eye, the dot on the eye is a little basketball. Cool. It's so boring. What is, there, there's nothing on there. Oh my Lord. This is, I think this is F as well. This is so bad. Oh, is it, it's better than the Celtics at least. There's just nothing on there. Why does it look like a snack, like crisps or something? Oh, Los Angeles Lakers. Okay. They first of all they got the color scheme right. Thank God. It's purple and it's gold or purple and yellow. I think there's and they have the same lettering as the normal logo. It just says Lake Show. I wish there was more more going on here or the lettering was bigger. Like if you look at this, there's just like a lot of empty space. The color gradient's kind of nice. I think it's a solid B or something. Thank you for getting the colors right. Memphis Grizzlies. I... Memphis has had red jerseys before, I think. Uh, the lettering's cool, and then it's just empty. Um, mm, D tier. Uh, actually, like, low D tier. Heat culture. Hey, it's red. I think it's better than the last one, but also this, this, this is kind of like red on red. I don't like the lettering on culture at all. Also, there's nothing going on. It's just red. It's just a sea of red. This is also D tier again. At least they got the color right. Uh, put it here. Milwaukee Bucks. Okay. This is an step. This first of all, this is not the main colors, but this is an established color scheme. They have done cream and blue a bunch before. I can live with that. I like this little line here. It adds something. At least it's not completely empty. The lettering is good. It's They've used it before. It's established. I could give this a B. Okay. Minnesota Timberwolves. I'm sorry. It's too small. The lettering's too small. It's tiny. I, I know it's a long city name, but still. Five gum head ass? Exactly. What is this, bro? It's... Oh, and then there's just nothing down here. If you're gonna go with something like this, put it across the entire jersey. Land of 10,000 lakes? That's kind of cool. But that's all I can... That's all I have to say for you. You are D tier. You are... Actually, this Pistons jersey, even if the color is wrong, is still better than this Heat jersey. Just looking at it again. Sorry. New Orleans Pelicans. I, why, why, why is it gold now? You know, they did kind of have the purple and green. They had the Joker Halloween Day of the Dead jerseys. That kind of made sense. I guess they still have bones on here. That's cool. Uh, the green... Uh, the green and gold, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. I'm sorry. 
the rest is fine. The rest is fine, which I think puts you in... Actually, in C. Top of C, maybe. Ah, uh, you know what? No. Over here, probably. Okay, New York Knicks. These are similar to last year's, but basically, instead of black, they're white now. I like the pinstripes. I actually do like the lettering. The, like, the double doubling up. Yeah, I like this. And you know what? Is this, Do I love this jersey? No, I don't. I think there's been better city jerseys, but... At least it it's it has the color scheme correct. There's something going on, uh, and if it like looking at how it stacks up against the competition, I think it's gotta be S. So it's just a very weak field. Okay, Oklahoma City Thunder. This they've used this color scheme before. They've done they've done red, yellow, and black before. I don't hate it. I actually like that there's something going on here on the side. It's pretty good. It's a it's it's giving a bit McDonald's, but that's fine. That's fine. I think it's high B. Orlando Magic. These are good. These are great. Wow, these are great. These are great. They've, there's a lot of texture here. The the lettering is iconic. Uh, I mean, it's a bit colorless, but I don't really uh, mind it too much. I think this is probably S tier. I think I like these more than the Knicks, actually. I feel like they got an AI to make all these. Listen, with what's happening at, at Nike, it wouldn't even surprise me, to be honest. Philadelphia 76ers. Oh no, it's actually good. It actually incorporates the Sixers colors and there's something going on here and it says brotherly love. This is the this is an established lettering. I like it. They've used it before. It's good. A tier. Okay, Phoenix Suns jersey, amazing. Amazing. The valley, we got the we got the star, we got the we got the purple and orange. Very cool shape, pattern on the side. Only thing is that I don't love is that there's green in here for whatever reason. It doesn't really fit. I think this is S. I think that I have to put this S. I think it is it. I think it's better than the Knicks jersey. I don't know. Ah, you know what? It's also better than the Magic jersey because of the color. Portland Trailblazers. You, yeah, it's good. It's good. It's, it has red, which is Portland. I think there's too much gray on it, but at least there's like a pattern on here. There's some, there's a little, there's a little bit of white over here. Maybe if there was, I think I would have liked more red for the Blazers, but hey. Okay. I think it's A or B. Hmm. I think maybe B, maybe like, actually low B. Kings. This is, I like this. But this doesn't have anything to do with the Kings. I think they might have done this last season as well. No, it's, I'm sorry. It's just way too generic. This could be literally any team if it didn't say Kings on the front. I'm sorry. I think this is like C or D maybe. San Antonio. They've used this color scheme last season as well, I think. But I think they reduced too much. They took too much off of it. They had this whole Fiesta thing and everything. Uh... Why why is there like there's just nothing on here. There's nothing. It's it's kind of sad. Uh so I I would probably put this uh, like low C. Okay, now this is the big one. The Toronto Raptors jersey. They brought back the Raptor with like the jersey on it and the ball and everything. I love, I love this jersey so much. I think I'm gonna, I'm like, Raptors are probably my second favorite team. I think I'm probably buying this jersey. I think it's so sick. I think for this, I don't do this a lot. I'm, I'm usually a tearless purist, but I, I will be making an S plus tier for this. Wait, but let me, let me show you something real quick. Ta-da! I also, I already have, like, one of those, like, it's not really a jersey in the same sense. Actually, it might be. But this is, just, like, very big raptor. Is he eating the ball? Yeah. He is. <laughs> Greedy raptor, do not, do not let him get two balls. Do not let him get two balls. 
Utah. I feel like this is the exact same jersey as last year. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. This is great. I love this jersey. You have the mountains. It's it it's white for Salt Lake. The lettering's good. I like the purple. There's some accents. The blue works well with it. This is a this is a great jersey. Um, I think this is S tier as well. Okay, last one. Washington Wizards, the District of Columbia. I really like, like the the. The, what they did on the holes, like the armholes and the, the head hole, like the... I like the texture. I also like the lettering a lot. I think it's really, really good. Unfortunately, these colors don't really fit. And there's just nothing going on down here. Like, below this line, there is nothing going on at all. It's just white, which is kind of sad. Because otherwise, I think they could have done something really cool with this. So this is probably, like... C tier. This is my list. Let me know what you think. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next time.